It's me, Rab. I need a wee word with you. Can I come in? Just you in here, eh, laddie? I was hoping to speak to your pals, too. Could you ask them to join us? It's Jade. The lassie I was fighting with in the tournament. She's missing. I've looked all over town, but she's nowhere to be found. I can't help but worry she's got herself caught up in something. Will you help an old man look for his wee friend? You're a star. With yourself and your pals here to help, I'm sure we'll find her in no time. Right. The last place anyone saw her was over by the orphanage. Let's start there, shall we? else wants some.
Brought you a fresh one! is who's behind it all. Sir Hendrik must have missed one when he cleared the monsters out of town all those years ago. <laughs> <sighs> Nicely done, lassie. I hope you'll forgive me, but we had a wee rummage around in your room, Vince. The liquid I found. And that's what you drink before your fights, isn't it? What your friend here squeezes from the fighters you kidnapped. That... that was you? <laughs> Perhaps. 
Not all humans are as stupid as our muscle-bound friend here. That's right, old man. Hendrix scarred me, but he did not kill me. The extract. It was the only way to regain my strength. So I had Vince bring me the delicious to morsels. And why would he help me do such a thing, you ask? Because I offered to share the fruits of my labor, to give him strength beyond imagining. Who could refuse such a juicy offer, hmm? <laughs> I couldn't keep on winning forever. And if I wasn't winning, I wasn't bringing in the money we needed for the orphanage. Sorry, partner, but I can't let those kids down. Which means I can't let you and your friends leave. Come on, not now! Oh, will you look at yourself, laddie? Do you not see what that stuff's doing to you? That foul fluid wasn't meant for human consumption. It's eating you from the inside out. It's a miracle you're still alive. Uh, oh, man. Uh, I guess cedars never prosper, huh? <laughs> Spent at last, old friend. Such a shame. Then I suppose I'll have to deal with you myself. Keep that thing busy. I'll see if I can get those people down. <laughs>
And don't come back. I... I had no choice. A third-rate fighter like me? I was never gonna make enough dough to keep the place open. So when I heard that voice... drifting up from down here... right beneath the orphanage... I... I listened. All I had to do was help him out, and he'd make me the toughest fighter around. Seemed like a pretty sweet deal. So I said sure. I wanted to win the tournament so bad, needed that money so bad, I let him use me. I knew it was wrong. But that orphanage, man, that's where I was raised. Those kids are my family. I had to do it. I... had to. <laughs> so you let your desire to help the Bairns get the better of you. Well, there's certainly been greater evils done for less good. Tell you what, I'll have a word or two with the Mayor. Don't worry, lad. We'll make sure the orphanage is looked after. So, chin up, eh? Just don't let me catch you making deals with nasty beasts again. <sighs> Sir, I... I don't know what to say. Wakey, wakey, little soldier. Come on now, time to get up. I said wake up! Morning, darling! Hate to drag you out of bed, but we need to head up to the arena. That prize they never got around to giving you? Well, they want to hand it over. Let's get moving, before they change their mind. <laughs> if you're looking for me, I'll be in the cheap seats. Don't forget to give me a wave.
right, everybody, it's time to bring this year's Masked Martial Arts Tournament to a close. It's prize giving time. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you our champions, the Invincibles! And now, to present the prize. Hold on, hold on. Seems kind of a shame to have the good folks of Octagonia come out and support us and not give them a show to enjoy. Why don't we make this interesting? I challenge you to a fight for the prize, partner. Winner takes all! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the gauntlet has been thrown down! Now that's the stuff champions are made of. No backing out now, unless you want to ride on your hands. <laughs> huh. Fooled you. I don't do that stuff no more. I fight clean or not at all. Now let's do this. <laughs> It's all over! The champ is down! We have a winner! Vince looked kind of weak out there. He sure did. What's gotten into him? Uh, I needed people to see that. To see that I ain't nothing without that juice. I never had what it takes to be the champ. You deserve that prize, man. Thanks. You taught me what it means to be a fighter again. I won't forget this time. We love you, Vince! Thanks for putting it on the line for us every time! You're a true champ, man! It gives me great pleasure to announce that the winner of the Rainbow is... This is bad. This is real bad. Huh? It's the Rainbow. It's gone. And all there was instead was this. And this letter, too. Looks like it's for you. Come and meet me in Dundrasil. I've something to show you. Don't worry about the rainbow. It's safe with me. What a shocking twist to end our tale, ladies and gentlemen. The grand prize snatched from under our champion's nose by none other than Old Man Rab! Will our hero journey to Dundrasil to claim what's rightfully his? How will it all end? I, for one, can't wait to find out! Dundrasil, huh? So it's back to where it all began. Hmm. <sighs>